Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I had a very busy Easter and my family let me out of house and home so I've been off recently and restocked my cupboards. My last video was my farm food shop and this video is my Aldi and Tesco shop. So this is what I've got. So I'm going to start with Aldi and at Aldi I spent £35.99. So I went for my milk. This is my husband's favourite milk. It's just um, a soy milk. They are now up to 85p each. Um, I just got nine, was it eight? Nine, eleven. Eleven. I usually get two boxes but we had some left. Because we only go shopping sporadically, um, we live quite a long way from shops, we do sort of stock up a bit when we go. So I bought 11 cartons of that one. And then I just bought four of the No Sugar Soy, which is the one I like. This is a different price, this is 50p. I had some left, so I just bought four to make sure I've got plenty in the cupboard. I bought two boxes of these wheat shreds for my husband. They are now up to $1.99 a box. Everything seems to go up every week. Like years ago, everything sort of went up every few months. Now it seems to be going up weekly. So these are $1.99 a box. I've got two boxes of those. I bought some coconut water for a change to go in my smoothies. This was $1.99. I think I will be watering that down to make it last. I bought two of these stir-in sun-dried tomato pasta sauces. My husband really likes these with his pasta. These were 89p. I got two of those. I bought two tins of fruit cocktail. I eat a high fruit diet. I love fruit. And these are really quite convenient for me to take to work. And they've got a ring pull, so I don't have to worry about opening them as well with tin opener inside in my car. These were 89p each. I thought I'd give them a try. I got one in juice and one in night syrup. I bought some sugar because I'm going to be making some cakes for coronation. And I don't know how many more times I'm going to go off shopping before then. So I thought I'll pick a bag up and put it in the cupboard. This is now £1.9 a bag. And this is Aldi. <laughs> Uh, mint Imperials, I always like to have a few around. These are now up to 75 pence. And then I bought these Walter the Worms. I can remember when they first bought these out and they were like about 60p or something. They're now £1.29p and it's only a small bag. You know, 170 grams it says. But I am starting to do some more running and I thought they'd be very handy to pop in a pocket to have when I'm off running. Uh, I bought some wraps. I'm going to make some enchiladas for my husband. Um, these were 99p. My bananas. I miss my bananas. The last time I went off, I didn't get many. So I did buy a few this time. I eat a lot of banana and ice cream and a lot of smoothies. I thought I'd bought all the um, 89p ones for, with five big bananas in. But when I looked at it, somebody must have put one back in the wrong place. And one of them was, I think it was 92 something like that for seven small ones amongst this some somewhere yeah so most of them I think I bought six and five or 89p for five big and then I think one was seven smaller ones for about 92 something along those lines so I got some bananas there don't know how long that will last probably not very long but I will have to put them in my airing cupboard to make them ripen because some of them are a little bit green I bought two loaves of my husband's favourite bread. This is the lightly seeded. This is a, still 85p a loaf. So I got two of those. I split that, put it in the freezer. Bought some anti-back wipes. These were £1.09p. Um, it doesn't say how many are in there, does it? Let's have a look. Oh yeah, 72. So 72 wipes in there. And I also bought some washing up liquid, 60p, just the citrus one as I can't find my beloved Morning Fresh anywhere at the moment. I bought four little tins of these pate things for the old farm cat. These were 37p each. She's actually gone very fussy at the moment. And I bought her some porcelain pockets because although she's fussy, I still like to spoil her. These were 75p. And that was Aldi. I think that's a lot. Yes, there's only a real small load of shopping from Aldi. And as I say, that came to £35.99p. And then I went into Tesco's. Um, so Tesco's, this is it. I bought a big box of the own brand Rice Krispie things. They were 85p. That's pretty good actually, I think. That's um, 375 grams. 
I bought a big box of cornflakes. Try and find the weight who are 720. That was on a club card deal for £2.50. That is my husband's favourite, favourite breakfast. I bought some PG Tips tea bags. They were on a club card deal for £2 and that was for 80 bags. Then I bought some curry sauce mix. My husband loves this curry sauce mix with microwavable rice. It's a quick and easy tea, nights I'm working or if he's working late. This is £3. I cannot believe this brand of products has gone so expensive, but I can't find an own brand. So, um, you know, he works really hard. If he wants a curry sauce, he has a curry sauce, but it's now £3. I did buy two because it's hard to get hold of. So I got that. I bought him some digestive biscuits. They were just 55p and brand. I bought this toothpaste. I'm not fussy with my toothpaste. I'll clean my teeth with anything really. This was just 50p. That'll do the job. Uh, bought some bleach, 60p. The pot noodles won a club card deal for 70p each. They're really handy for my husband's lunch. All our shopping does the two of us three meals a day. We don't eat out or have food anywhere else. We take pack lunches or my husband works a lot from home, has food. So I got him, is it five? Five pot noodles, 70p on a club card. I bought this gravy. I like the reduced salt one. And as I say, the branded one has gone ridiculously pricey. So we're trying all the different own brands to see what they're like. This one was 95p treat myself to these. My daughter actually bought some of these for me for Easter. They're like a, a vegan salted caramel cup. They were so delicious. You don't get that many in a pack. So I thought, oh, I'm going to get some. That was £1.23 for that little pack. I bought some salad cream. That's one ninety nine. I think once they put that word in anything, it gives them license to sort of triple the price. Um, bought some tomato puree to make enchiladas that was 49p I bought a kilo of this is just oats this is for porridge for breakfast that was £1.25 for those I bought some tomatoes I'm going to try and eat some pasta if you saw my farm food shop I bought a big bag of pasta and I'm trying different things with it and I like these tomatoes. They always taste a bit more tomatoey, this brand, than other brands, even though it's a bit more expensive. But these were on a club card deal for 75p, so I did buy two of those. I also bought two tins of Heinz beans. I didn't realise quite how expensive they were. They were £1.40. £1.40 for a tin. I mean, this sort of stuff used to be staple. When you were a bit broke at the end of the week when I was a kid, you had beans on toast for tea. And it used to be like a cheap meal, but now £1.40 is getting a bit pricier. I bought two bags of carrots. These were 40 p. I bought two bags before having carrot sticks with my lunch. And I bought two cucumbers. These were 79p each. So I'll be having carrot sticks and cucumber and salad cream um, as part of my lunches. My husband had tried the Tesco and brown soup, said it was fine. So these were 75p, so I bought half a dozen of those again for lunches. I treated him, he loves this pizza. We used to get one from Aldi, but they've stopped doing it again now. So now and again, I do get this one. This was £4, and he'll be having that for tea tonight. And because I treated him to a stuffed barbecue jackfruit pizza, I decided to get my, my favourite yoghurt. I just bought the one because these are now up to £1.20, which is a ridiculous price for a yoghurt. So I just bought one. Uh, bought some Cathedral City cheese. This is for the, the enchiladas and for him to have um, crackers, cheese, whatever. Three twenty five. Then I bought these butters. I'd stocked up last year on Vitalite when it was on offer and I had a freezer full. We're now down to nothing so i found out this i can't believe it's not butter is actually vegan so i bought that that was one pound fifty and then i just bought this to do some baking because i'm making cakes for the coronation and it was 99p and then when i've put things out now i've seen that that is also vegan so we are going to do a bit of a taste test and see what they're like because we've used vital like the years but we thought we'll try these. I don't eat a lot of butter anyway. So my husband will see um, what he thinks on his toast and 
we're say we're trying different things to buy cheaper things. So we'll we'll watch this space and we'll we'll see how it goes. I bought some squash. This is just the own brand. It's only small bottles, but it's double strength. These are just 45p each. So I bought two orange and one black currant. And then I did buy this bottle of white grape and black sparkling water. This was 60 pence. And this we will have with our meal later. So that was my Tesco shop and my Aldi shop. Tesco's before the club card deals, it was 56 pound and three pence. And then, oh, I've got hiccups, excuse me. After the club card, it was £52.23. and pence. So again, I don't live near a Tesco's. I won't be going again for a while. Uh, we are thinking of trying in the future to do like, see if we can do a weekly shop online and see how much it actually costs us weekly. Because it, it does seem, because we go sporadically, I think we do spend a bit more money and because you go around the shop we sort of impulse buy a bit more whereas I think if we did it online and we just stuck to a budget and a menu it might save us a little bit of money but I mean we don't go mad mad but we'll see how it goes anyway this is my Aldi and my Tesco shop for now thank you for watching don't forget to like and subscribe and until next time stay frugal